What's going on here, squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Sunday, June 6th, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out my voice, just <laughs> checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that is in the corner, your left hand bottom corner, and it's in a hashtag below the video and in the description box below. I feel like I have too much fun with, the, <laughs> with this intro, at least today, maybe. Um... I say it every day. I've been saying it every day for at least a year now. But um, first things first. Did I say the thing about uh, Madame Nazar? If I didn't, if you guys want to know Madame Nazar, I did say that. I did. I'm not gonna say it again. Anywho, uh, first things first. Let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which is in the same spot she was yesterday. She's down here near Rio Bravo. And this is the spot I was trying to mention to you guys. If you looked at the video yesterday, I was trying to tell you guys about the camp that was behind her and I didn't think you could get it. I thought it was a little bit closer, like up here, but I mean, apparently you can. That is like the perfect camp to get to go to her. Then you can go back to the, to the camp and fast travel out of there. But she's in the same spot. She will be here maybe until... 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know, or not of America. How I personally get to her is I simply fast travel to my, put, place my camp out here in Rio Bravo, and I try to get a camp, well, wherever I, I put my camp spawns, I just go with it. From, from like, now, I just go with it. I don't, because it, it'll be closer than Tumbleweed or Armadillo either way. So I just go with it. But this isn't the camp that I had. I think my camp was up here somewhere. I'm not 100. No, it was it was the one right here because I didn't have to go find her today. But um, hopefully you guys get a good camp when you are trying to get to her. That's the simplest way I find to get her when she's over here near this uh, Rio Bravo Plainview location. But I mean, that's me. Uh... As I said, she will be here until 2 a.m. The cycles are available between 8 and 8 every day. Uh, the next thing I want to get to is the antique alcohol bottle, which is the Caribbean rum. I have a couple things for you guys as well, like with that. Fast travel up here to Coulter, which this is what that is. Coulter right here. It should spawn you up in here. Go to one of these houses to make sure I'm going to the right one go to this house right here and as soon as you enter and the cabinet right next to the door that's where you will find the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle for today also there's a tarot card in the house right next door right here which is a eight of Pentacles so go get, grab that it's right on the top of the table there's also a tarot card right here if you see that little smudge right there i don't know if you guys can see that but right there at that location you will find a random fossil i cannot tell you guys what it is because it is a fossil it's randomized so when you do come over here in this area pull out your metal detector and that's what you will get a random fossil let's go over here to where we normally do business which is the lemoyne area of the map all the way over here the cycles for today Sunday June 6th are 
Family Heirloom Cycle 5, All Lost Jewelry Cycle 1, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 6, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Terror Card Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 1. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Let's get to these things that we will find across the map. I'm going to try to do this kind of quick because, I, I mean, I feel like I've told you guys how to get these and all that stuff, like, a lot. So, I'm going to try to go through it quick, kind of explaining how, but not giving as much detail. Um, first things first, let's go up here to this first marker, which there's not much up here. There's, like, flowers and stuff, but I didn't waste my time marking those. I didn't I feel like those aren't as important, but... Let's get to this first mark marker underneath the word Lagrasse or Lagra. Right here on this island, you guys will get a random arrowhead. You will need your metal detector for this one. So come over here with that. Uh, let's start over here. Right here at this location, you guys will need your metal detector for this one. This is a fossil. There's also a tarot card right here. I cannot remember which tarot card it is, but it's right on the side of this barn. Like the awning of this barn, I think on a stack of hay, a bale of hay. Uh, let's get to this next marker, which is a lost jewelry. This lost jewelry is a Ainsworth cross necklace. It's on the table inside the church. So you have to make your character squat down and walk in and get it off the back table. Uh, this is a miniature church, by the way. Let's go down by the N and NWA. Right here at this location, you guys will get a bird egg. This bird egg is a egret egg. It's in a tree, so shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Right here at this next marker, which is at the U of Bayou. Right here at this location, you guys will get another fossil. Come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get. Right here inside this house, there's two things actually. Right here where this marker is in the corner, there's a tall wardrobe, a tall green wardrobe. Open the wardrobe and you guys will get a ebony hairpin. And right on the other side, right here, there's a bookshelf. And on that bookshelf, you guys will see an Eight of Wands tarot card. Eight of Wands tarot card. Let's go over to the left a little bit more to this house. Inside this house, there's actually two things, which one is a antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a scotch whiskey bottle. It's on the table on the right, as soon as you walk in with all the candles and stuff. And there's a rosewood hairbrush, which is a family heirloom. This family heirloom is on the red love seat in the cabin. That's on the left side, the complete other side. And that it's on a, a red love seat, so go grab that as well. Let's go over. There's also a family heirloom right here. Like right about here. It's like on the side of this uh, big shack or cabin or whatever you want to call this. But it's a jade hairpin. You come over here with your metal detector. And that's what you will get. It's like by a broken down outhouse. Hence. Anyway, let's get to this marker right here that's by the S and Saint. Right here at this location, on like a white wicker looking outside furniture, uh, patio furniture type of situation, you guys, it's like a love seat, like a wicker outside furniture love seat. But on this love seat or bench, you guys will get a New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush, which is a family heirloom. Let's go over to our next marker which is a antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is on the second floor. So how you get there is you go up the ladder right here, walk across the path, jump across the railing, walk across that little path, jump across the railing again, and go around, follow the path around to about right here. It's sitting on your right in the crack of like a doorway or whatever. And this antique alcohol bottle is a Irish whiskey bottle, by the way. Is at the last door, if you guys don't know. <laughs> right here at this next marker is a six of wands. It's inside this saloon. It's a tarot card. It's inside the saloon. You go through the door and go straight to the back. It's on a shelf at the back room, in the back room. 
let's go over to our next marker which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for the day and if you guys cannot find any of these items make sure you switch lobbies first before you let me know <laughs> or you think they wrong comment down in the section below and if you see anything that's wrong ever with the channel uh, let me know and I will be able to help out in some kind of way. I will try. There's a a chimney right here. Like it's like a house that broke down or burned down. And the chimney is left right here. In that chimney, you guys will get a pearl rue pearl necklace, which is a lost jewelry. Right next to that, you will see a outline of a house. Go in the middle of that outline and pull out your metal detector, and you guys will get a random coin right inside the O of meadows over here inside this house there's a couple things well there's a couple things over here in this area right here on this circle there's a tarot card that tarot card is a knight of wands i think that's like a a, a whale or something like that. i don't know a, a basin anyway right here at this location on the ground floor dinner table you guys will get a london dry gin antique alcohol bottle so go grab that as well i have a couple more things for you guys which are basically inside of roads right here next to this square super close to it come over here with your metal detector and you guys will get another family heirloom this family heirloom is a carved wooden hairpin it's right between this foundation and a like a small wagon and the next thing is inside the one of these rooms right here there's a room here and there's a room here the item that you're looking for is inside of this second room right here it's in the chest at the foot of the bed on the ground floor right here at this location this item is a goat hairbrush which is a family heirloom so go and grab that i have a couple tarot cards for you guys there's a tarot card here on the ground floor i think on a stack of boxes or crates this is a six of pentacles tarot card there's a tarot card right next to the fence on a barrel right here and that is a five of wands and there's a tarot card over here through this there's a little walkway over here like a walkthrough area next to this barn or i guess connected to this barn uh is on a barrel and there's a Eight of Swords tarot card. I feel like I was just talking like a lot. Um, inside this house right here, on the fireplace, you guys will get a Ten of Pentacles tarot card as well. But that's pretty much it for the extras that I have for you guys. I'm going to put this back in focus. The cycles for today, once again, today, Sunday... June 6th, once again, our Family Heirloom Cycle 5, All Lost Jury Cycle 1, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 6, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Terror Card Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 1. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 5, All Lost Jury Cycle 1, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 6, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 1, All Terror Card Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and fossils cycle one <laughs> thank you guys for watching thank you guys for looking listening uh watching the video all the way through if you did make it to this point my birthday is june 7th so drop happy birthday in the comment section below for me for your main man hit man <laughs> If you did make it to this point. If you don't, I understand. It's okay. I mean, you know what I'm saying? I don't expect everybody to do me right. <laughs> but thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for looking. Thank you guys for liking, sharing, commenting, all that. I do appreciate the ones that really do. Thank you guys for subscribing because that's very important to me. Uh, anywho, it's your main man, Hitman. Make sure you guys like, share, comment, hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet. And um, that's pretty much it. 
I'm out.